saddle here, Pike. Come on, move your back. Really smoking, you can really smell the smoke too. I don't know what fire it's from, but boy, you can really see it and smell it. Burns the lungs a bit. What's that? Uh, this is my second time for this particular hike, but I try and hike whenever possible. I've done Mount Whitney twice, as well as other backpack trips. Yeah, starting at Onion Valley, so it's a total of 55 miles. What's that? Yes. Yeah, it was a hard, uh, hard trip. <laughs> uh, I did it the first time in six days. And now Whitney's no joke. That, that last day, oh, it was brutal. Uh, July. Oh yeah, there's no way you'd be able to do it then. The trail to the to the summit is very dangerous, and if you cover that with snow, you're probably gonna die. Yeah, trust me, it's easier. It does look like one. Right on the head. Now that thing can still bite, yeah, so. Yeah, it buried the head or something. Yeah. Now it cooks up up here. <laughs> He's a little small to eat, but he, he was right in the, in the trail. That's a very young one, which makes them even more dangerous. Yeah, they haven't learned to control their venom output yet. Exactly, and they don't have those rattles. <laughs> so, I'm glad you didn't get bit. <laughs> you gonna have the dog eat it? No. <laughs> Why not? Why don't you take a picture? Nah. Are they real good? Oh, wow. You wanna take a picture of me? I killed the snake, yeah! You want to smell it? No, he doesn't care. <laughs> you want to see it, Abby? Rattlesnake? Oh, they hatch and they go off on their own. Yeah, it'll do that for a while. I've uh, gutted and... Wait, let me see. Yeah. I, I cut the head off, yeah. Where's the head? Toss it down the hill. Oh, why? Because it can still bite you. Oh, wow. Yeah. I wanted to see it, though. Yeah. Well, it's rather dangerous to handle. With the head on it? Well, the, the head in general, because even if it's dead, even if, like, you say you were to step on it, it could bite you and dump all its venom in you. Go. You want to hold it, Vince? Snake tacos. <laughs> Snake tacos. <laughs> Thankfully, it wasn't a big one because had he stepped over that, it would have bit him. Are there any big ones around? Oh, yeah. That's why I brought the rifle. But I didn't need to use it on that one. It kind of wanted to be left alone, but the fact that it was that it was right in the middle of the trail. 
and I don't want to walk over it or have the dog walk over it. Potentially like get that. negotiate with the dog. Because <laughs> it was hostile. <laughs> See, look at that. It's curling around my fingers. <laughs> well, poor Abby. <laughs> huh? We're at the saddle? Yeah, we're on top of the saddle. Hey guys, let's take a break on top here. Come here. Let's take a break. Siegfried. Go on. Siegfried, come on. Well, we'll go ahead and take a break right up here. I gotta water him too, so. Yeah, it does. We'll keep going, but we're going to take a quick rest here for 5-10 minutes, and I can water him. What's that? Uh, mile, mile and a half, something like that. Yeah. So I'll go to mile coming up then? Around that, I think. My best estimation. <laughs> Four point seven miles round trip. Well, going uphill, it seems like it, like you go farther, but but you don't. Yeah. I don't know. You could probably uh. Or, you you could probably uh save the skin maybe. You want to see it? You want to hold it? That's good. I love the way they feel. You want to smell it? Hey, see. Hmm? Nothing? See, oh, I don't care. <laughs> I love the way the muscles feel. I don't. Come here, Vince. It's awesome. Now eat it, survive it. Just chop down on it. I think this is just a hiking trail. No, it's no, it's, no, it's, no, it's definitely it's Rincon's it's like okay, motorcycle. One. This isn't Rincon. This is not Rincon. This is Paddle Sack Cave Trail. Rincon's further down the road, uh, back from where we came. Wait a minute, wait, you came that way? Yeah, th this is Paddle Sack. This is up, uh, from McNally's, Rincon's uh, be, uh, before McNally's. Yeah, this is McNally's. from McNally's? You, you came from McNally's? Well, the, the trailhead is just past McNally's, uh, McNally's but Rincon's before. No, no, this is Rincon. This no. is not Rincon. Trust me. You got a map? I do not. We don't have it either. But this is definitely not Rincon. And you, is it difficult to hike out of here? Or to walk out of here? Or ride out of here? Probably not. It'll probably be narrow. Yeah, it gets, but it gets better than this. Though. Yeah, it can be like this a little bit. Yeah, right. once does you it, hit the does saddle, does it come out at a road? It does come out at a road, but yeah, this isn't Rincon. Did you not come from this direction? No, we came from the top of Rincon Trail. Oh, then you're coming out Palisade Cave. No, but the Palisade Cave is on this route. Well, yeah, but this isn't Rincon. This is the Palisade Cave Trail. It has a sign and everything. Yeah, but the, the, it's on the Rincon Trail. The Palisade Cave Trail should be on the Rincon Trail. I've never seen another trail other than going to the cave. I've never seen any other trail. Oh, because if, if you stay on that, if you pass the cave, when you come to the cave over there, it's going to be on your left. The cave, will be, the cave trail will be on your left. It'll say no motorcycles. Okay. And if you keep going straight, uh, then it comes out at the Sherman Pass Road. So that then it says Rincon Trail right there. Okay. So it'll say Rincon Trail just past the paddle, the left hand turn of the paddle sack cave. It'll okay. say Rincon Trail. Well, just be real careful because this isn't a real wide trail and this is a popular trail, so there are hikers. Oh, yeah, no, it, we've There's got it. Boy and uh, did you see any other dirt bike uh, dirt bike oh, markers on this trail? Any more dirt bike? Uh, no, I didn't see any. Any knobbies anywhere along this route? Mm -mm. Huh. So how far is it to the road? Like maybe a mile and a half. Oh, really? Yeah, not real far. Not real far. 
Huh. And it's all downhill, so it'll be quick. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's Once good. you hit the saddle, it's all downhill. Oh, okay. That's good. We're gonna t we're gonna end up taking that, but then we'll have to check the map and see. But yeah. if it goes to the road, it goes near McNally's. That's about where we're gonna we expect. To yeah, because Rincon should I do believe it's uh, before McNally's, and McNally's is uh, pretty close to the pack. So it's like we're just don't lean against me. You're gonna push me off. Um, it the trailhead is just past McNally's. Yeah. So. But if you if you walked up from McDowell's and you were on a trail, was there like a dirt road or a forest road or any kind of a wider road that went to your right? Yeah, you, there, there was some, but it was before McNally's. Yeah, that that's what I think. I think when we go down, we would stay on that road and keep going further south, and that'll come out at Rincon. Yeah, because there were two. Remember, she went right, and there was a wider. Trail. No, 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 that dead ended at the yeah, that concrete revetment. Oh, it did it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That ended? So. Oh. But no, the, the Rincon Trail, because I, I saw it when we were coming up, oh, yeah. it's before McNally's. It's yeah. probably, oh. I don't know, maybe a mile, okay, well, thanks, two miles down the road. Well, I'm glad we can get out. That's good. Yeah. And you might see those guys. They were having a little bit of hard time when we were waiting here for them. And they're not turning on their radio. And they're probably <laughs> stuck in there. So okay. uh, you, if you could just get, if you can give them a little word of encouragement that this sure. part is not going to be that hard. <laughs> yeah, no problem. Just and then we'll, when we get to the highway, some of us have license plates. We're going to ride the canal trail okay. and take that. That'll be a lot easier for them. So the rest okay. is going to be easier. They're just having a hard time through there because no they're slipping around in the wetness and the logs. Okay. Oh, just yeah. be careful of any other hikers that you might see. Oh, yeah. It's know. a pretty popular trail. Oh, so. yeah. yeah, we know. Yeah, thanks. Okay. No and problem. There's about 10 or 20 more Boy Scouts that way. Dang. Okay. So yeah, they're at the cave the right now. And oh, okay. It, uh, and they told us uh, up the that, that on the when left. we came out that this was the route down and out. And because they come up this way, I guess, yesterday. Okay. They camped at the campground hey, over there. Chris, I was just talking to them. And so they're going to be, uh, so uh, do they need help? Yeah, they right. help. Uh, he's, he just needed directions. Oh. oh. <laughs> directions. Well, you'll you'll see him. And we'll you guys going to camp over there tonight? No, no, we're just doing a day hike. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, 4.7 miles round trip. I heard the so. cave goes back pretty deep. It's a big cave. I'm, I think you could fit probably 100 to 150 people no in No kidding. It's huge. Wow. Right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's really. Is it a natural cave? Mm-hmm. <coughs> yeah, stalactites, stalagmites. Really? It's, yeah. No. It's huge. Oh, we got to come back and do that sometime. We should come back Yeah, you that. should check it out. It's yeah. it's, it's really quite. Oh, yeah. And Absolutely. I heard there's some little channels you can go spelunking into or go down deeper into. Uh, I'm no. not sure. I know there's a couple of spots like that become like small tunnels, but yeah. like really small. Too and small. I didn't want to try you don't and get in those. Huh? I didn't want to risk get getting stuck. Again. Yeah. I don't blame you. But uh, you know, I I explored explored pretty much the vast majority. I don't think you can really go spelunking, but yeah, but you can but go in pretty good. But it's it's pretty spectacular. Well, that's worth the trip. So, yeah, we gotta do that one time. And Salmon oh, Creek Falls, did you pass the cutoff for that? Yeah. You passed the cutoff for Salmon Creek Falls? Yeah, I believe that's, uh, I think that's before Rincon. No, when you were on your hiking trail, you didn't pass. Oh, no, 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 no. There's no other branching. Okay, okay that's fine. Yeah. Okay. He's from, uh, okay, that's good. So. All right. Alrighty, well, thank you well, very much. probably see him. Just let them know that they're going to be, like, probably huffing and puffing. <laughs> okay. You guys be safe. Okay, have fun. Have a great hike uh, in the cave, and you'll be you'll cool down in there, huh? Yeah, absolutely. Streams flowing over there. There's a nice waterfall down there. Cool. You'll see. All right. Thank you very much. You have a safe trip. You too. Have a great hike. Thanks. Take care. Have fun. You too. And then we decide to camp out. All right, man. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Take it easy, brother. Happy hiking. Thanks. You too. Oh, we got scouts coming up. Go. Uh, probably somewhere. Let's get off the trail, guys. Let these guys pass. They got a bigger group. Siegfried, come. Come here. No, not at all. You might have the virus. Sorry. Oh. What is? How's it going, guys? Good morning. How many are with you? Uh, 14 total, but we're spread out. Oh, okay. Alrighty. It's easier. It's easier. <laughs> no, that's Whitney. <laughs> like when you're when you're going downhill from the portal, oh my or towards the portal, man, you wish yep yeah, you wish you were going up because What's up? Back home we cross towns, you know, that's hours. That's a road like this. 
Siegfried, no. This way. Go. Siegfried, come. <laughs> Go. Go, come on. Heel. I might be halfway through this valley And my eyes just can't see a quick way out